Hello YouTube and welcome to another retro unboxing video of a graphics card that I recently got. Um, yeah, this graphics card is a very uh, rare, rare card. Um, it's even rarer in Sweden, which I bought it. So yeah, uh, according to the seller, uh, he has not tested the card, so he doesn't know if it works or not. So we was bidding on a maybe a dead card or a working card. So we had a, a little bid war. <laughs> so yeah, and ended up winning it. So um, yeah, let's jump right to the unboxing. Um, and uh, let's see what we got. Uh, right off the bat, the packaging is not the best. Um, well, this is a protective bag, but um, I can feel the car moving around inside here. And that is not a good sign. Um, I wish, wish some people actually filled it up so it, the card or the items inside can't move around in shipping. That could cause damage, but he don't. He doesn't know if the card works or not. He he has sold it. So yeah, if it's dead, if it's dead, if it's not, well that's good. But uh, these old cards, especially these old uh, dual core or dual GPU cards, have an often not. God damn, often not working. So I don't have very high hopes. Just a cool card to own. Yeah, it's only the card. In it's so long, so it has actually has <laughs> two anti-static bags. So I'm gonna move that away. And here is the card. This is one of the actually one of the coolest cards so this is the actually it's the PNY Quadro FX 4500 X2 and why it's called X2 it's because it's a dual core or dual GPU core and it's the sandwich one so it actually it's two cards sandwiched together it's actually two 7900 GTX cores on one card and it is a unique card it really looks good it actually looks to be in really good shape so you have the standard 7800 GTX cooler where it looks like that I really don't know what these ports are so if you someone know or someone knows please comment that so yeah you got the two six pins over there it really looks cool it's a dual PCB you got the two SLI fingers there so you can actually run two of these which gives you four GPUs and you got a hole here for the sandwich cooler to actually access some air so that's really cool let's see if it will out of focus here yeah here we go let's see here yeah you can see here it's the Quadro FX4500 X2 so you got four come on focus man you got four DVI's and one S video actually reminds me of the Radeon 3870X2 which I got I have an unboxing of that many years ago. I also have four DVIs. So yeah, that's pretty much it. I don't I don't know that much about this card. 
I only know that it's uh, more or less a 7900GX2 or a GTX Duo which came in an OEM pre-built systems it actually looks pretty much the same but it's way harder to get so I got the Quadro version instead so yeah it really looks good actually it's and it's pretty long actually the the 7950GX2 which which sold to the customers or in retail it's a, like this long and has some different cooler so yeah I'm just gonna show you a comparison between this card and my 5970 so I'm just gonna be right back alright so I'm back this is my dusty <laughs> 5970 which is the longest card I own but actually you know what take a look at that it's actually they're pretty much the same god damn Pretty much the same. I'm gonna stand them up. Oh yeah. Yeah, they're exactly the same. Actually, the quadro card is pretty longer, it's a couple of millimeters. But yeah, you you know the you see the difference there. So yeah, this pretty much covers the video, and um, I will be back if I know the cards work or not. So yeah, stay tuned. Yeah, uh, I just test this card, and um, it is dead, unfortunately. Unfortunately, it's dead. Uh, it boot up, but it's got artifacts all over the screen. So yeah, that's pretty bummer. And I really can't see any damage on the PCB actually. So yeah, it's just... So when I have the time, I'm gonna try to revive it. I'm gonna try to change the paste and pads and uh, yeah if that doesn't work I'm gonna try to revive it in the oven I revived uh, one 8800 GTX before and that actually survived for like uh, another year or so so yeah unfortunately it's dead okay that pretty much wraps the video up thank you for watching see you in the next one bye